Good afternoon. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Secretary General, ITU elected officials, excellencies, distinguished delegates, ladies and gentlemen. It is a pleasure for the Internet Society to attend the 2014 World Telecommunications Development Conference here in Dubai. We thank our gracious hosts, the Government of the United Arab Emirates, and appreciate their kind, kind hospitality. The Internet Society is a global cause-based organization dedicated to the belief that global communications and the Internet can transform the lives of people worldwide. Everyone in every country should have access to the opportunities of the global, that the Global Information Society provides. From its very beginning, the Internet Society has been committed to Internet development. Early ISOC pioneers deploy technical infrastructure in emerging markets and train many of the people who are now Internet leaders in their local communities. Since 2008, ISAC has trained nearly 1,000 people in 16 countries across Africa alone. We have trained in network management, the domain name system, internet exchange points, and in interconnection technologies. Our collective challenge these two weeks, these two next weeks, and going forward, is to harness this tremendous momentum to unleash innovation across all sectors of society to improve health care, to provide access to online banking, to reform education, and to create opportunities for our young people. The ITUD plays an important role in this regard. I am personally honored to participate in the ITU's Empowering Initiative, which aims to extend the full benefits of mobile technologies to remote and rural communities. Clearly, there are amazing success stories from countries around the world and lessons that can be learned from these successes. The ITUD provides a platform to discuss best practices and to build the partnerships that will provide future growth. We can all come together through organizations like those here, like the Internet Society, and many others to create the enabling environment for the next generation of technology to improve the efficiency of traffic exchange within countries and across borders, to build human capacity, and to strengthen network resiliency in order to withstand natural disasters. So these are the four priorities that form the basis of the Internet Society's contribution to the 2014 WTDC. First, an enabling environment for basic infrastructure investment in areas like submarine cables, mobile connectivity, and inter-exchange points. Second, cross-border connectivity, which can come in the form of regional partnerships and shared infrastructure projects. Third, capacity building, making sure that there is sufficient expertise on the ground, both individual and institutional, to support internet growth. One key area for partnership and collaboration between ISEC and the ITUD is the area of combating spam. We look forward to working more closely with the ITU development sector so that together we can connect policymakers with the technical community to address this challenging problem. Finally, fourth priority in a world that has 295 natural disasters in one year alone, we need to focus on emergency communications. In a crisis situation, continuity and stability of communications is critical. Thank you again for allowing us to address you. The Internet Society looks forward to helping set the development agenda. We come together with the deep knowledge that we all benefit when new communities and users come online. Thank you so much. Thank you.